At a Pentagon showcase in Arlington, Virginia, U.S. defense contractor L-3 Harris introduced its newest unmanned strike platform, the Red Wolf, designed to deliver precision attacks deep inside contested territory. The event featured next-generation military technologies aimed at strengthening the United States' ability to operate effectively across multiple warfighting domains. Among the cutting-edge prototypes on display, the Red Wolf drew particular attention as a modular, long-range kinetic weapon system built to enhance America's standoff strike capabilities. The Red Wolf is engineered to execute high-accuracy, deep penetration missions using guided kinetic munitions capable of eliminating high-value threats while minimizing unintended damage. Unlike traditional strike assets that rely on manned aircraft or closer-range weapon platforms, this unmanned vehicle allows U.S. forces to hit strategic targets from well outside enemy defensive zones, reducing the risk to pilots and expensive frontline aircraft. Categorized as an air-launched effects ALE, system, Red Wolf can be deployed from helicopters, fixed-wing aircraft, or even ground-based vehicles. ALEs act as forward-deployed sensors and weapons carriers, conducting reconnaissance, disrupting enemy defenses, relaying battlefield data, and executing precision strikes far ahead of manned units. This capability allows commanders to test enemy defenses, suppress threats, and gather vital intelligence without risking human lives. L3 Harris revealed few specifics about Red Wolf's performance but highlighted its modular, scalable design and autonomous targeting features. Powered by AI-based sensor fusion, the system can independently locate and prioritize targets while remaining fully adjustable to new mission parameters in real time. Its adaptable framework makes it compatible with a wide range of launch systems, supporting both tactical battlefield roles and long-range strategic strike missions. The Red Wolf is part of L3 Harris, Wolf Pack, series of multi-role unmanned vehicles capable of rapid integration with various platforms, including non-proprietary systems from other manufacturers. Notably, the Red Wolf has already demonstrated operational success when deployed from a U.S. Marine Corps AH-1Z Viper attack helicopter, showcasing its cross-platform flexibility, a milestone no other air-launched effect has achieved to date. This unveiling underscores the Pentagon's push for modernized long-range fires and autonomous combat solutions tailored for high-intensity conflict zones, particularly in regions like the Indo-Pacific and Eastern Europe where enemy defenses pose growing challenges. The Red Wolf's arrival signals a new phase in U.S. precision warfare, where unmanned, AI-driven strike assets could redefine how future conflicts are fought, delivering speed, survivability, and devastating reach without exposing human crews to frontline danger.